Hare Krishna, welcome to Mayapur. <laughs> I'm here for the lockdown, but usually I preach in the eastern part of Asia. I'm in countries like Thailand, Malaysia, Singapore, as well as Hong Kong, Taiwan, China, these places. So I wanted to tell you about our preaching using the Damodar uh, month during the auspicious month of Kartik when we promote the worship of Lord Damodar. We found it to be very helpful for contacting new people. In Malaysia, of course, there's a lot of Indian people as well as Chinese people and we find it's easy to approach them during the month of Damodar. We can go to their homes with devotees and we introduce the song to them. Everyone can understand a simple religious ceremony offering a candle. In Hong Kong, Hong Kong, you know, <laughs> those of you who have been to Hong Kong, it's a materialistic place and a lot of Chinese people there. Chinese people in Hong Kong are quite open-minded and many have a Christian upbringing, went to a Christian school, so when we invite them to offer a lamp, then it's something very easy, very easy for them to accept. And although we're out there in the street with the chanting, a few devotees chanting Hare Krishna Mantra, we have a picture of Lord Damodar and we invite them to come and offer a little ghee lamp to, to the Lord Damodar. And, and then we show them the books and they often get a book. They're happy, they like it. Everyone likes to take part in something. So this is the idea of the Damodar month. It gives everyone a chance to get involved. You know, that they can, they're, they're not just watching other people do something, like you go to the temple and you see people offer the RT. But Damodar month, people have a chance they can worship themselves. We give them the lamp and let them offer it. That's very satisfying to people to be able to do this. And then we explain to them about the significance of the month and the special song which we have. And from that time then people often start coming to the temple. And in the temple we also have a little altar at the side of the temple. Any time in the day they can come and they can offer it. We have a, a box of candles there. They can take a small candle and offer it to Lord Damodar. And in this way if they do it every day for a month, it has a very good effect on them. It helps them to make real progress in Krishna consciousness, they become a little attached to coming to the temple. So this is the idea of Damdar month. We like to, people to know a little bit about Krishna, how he is in so many different forms. He's a young child, he's a young boy, and he has a loving relationship with his mother. This is something everyone can appreciate. We like to give people a chance to understand more about Krishna and his wonderful pastimes. Mm -hmm.